Hello, fellow stargazers and welcome back to our channel. Today, we're diving into a cosmic mystery that's been baffling astronomers around the world. Stars, as we know them, are disappearing. Yes, you heard that right. Stars are vanishing from the sky. But where are they going? Let's find out. Stars don't just vanish, or do they? For thousands of years, astronomers believed that the lights in the sky were fixed and unchanging. Even when we discovered that these lights were actually physical objects like the sun, we assumed that they go through major changes very slowly, on timescales of millions or billions of years. But what if some stars suddenly just wink out of visibility? According to everything we know about stars, that should be impossible, but a group of astronomers has set out to see whether such impossible things do happen. They're comparing data across decades of observations. Enter Vasco, the vanishing and appearing sources during a century of observations project. Led by Beatrice Villaroel of the Nordic Institute for Theoretical Physics in Sweden, this team is on the hunt for vanishing objects in the sky. They're searching for a star that's been steady and has been there in the sky for as long as we can remember, and then one day, it just vanishes. Vasco is not just about variable stars that pulsate and change in brightness. They're looking for something different. They want to find something that goes from a completely steady star to just vanishing entirely, a phenomenon that hasn't been documented yet and could lead to new physics. With the help of automated telescopes like the Zwicky Transient Facility at Mount Palomar in California, and the use of historical data from the Samuel Oskin Telescope, the team is comparing data from 70 years ago to data from today to see how the sky might have changed. So far, the survey has delivered more than 800 apparently missing stars, many of which still need to be processed and studied in depth. And while there's no perfect match for a vanishing act by a long-lived, stable star, many of the candidates that have been spotted are still intriguing in their own right. If these 800 candidates turn out to contain an ideal vanishing star, what could be the possible explanation? One option might be a so-called failed supernova, a truly monstrous star with a core so massive that it collapses into a black hole and consumes the rest of the star from the inside out, leaving no visible remnant behind. But here's where it gets really interesting. What if these vanishing stars are not a natural phenomenon at all? What if they're the work of advanced alien civilizations? As we move into the era of big data in astronomy, many scientists believe that we're more likely to detect the presence of aliens through the otherwise inexplicable behaviors of stars and other objects than we are from radio signals. Could these vanishing stars be the result of stellar engineering by advanced civilizations? Could they be building structures like Dyson spheres, or even getting rid of stars that are getting in the way? Or could these red transients that the team has identified be the result of an alien laser beam? These are all possibilities that the Vasco team is considering. While the team has already made some exciting discoveries, there's still a lot of work to do. Only a quarter of the sky has been checked so far, and many of the candidates identified still await proper confirmation and analysis. But with the help of volunteer citizen scientists and new automation methods currently being developed, the search for vanishing stars continues. Stay tuned for more updates on this cosmic mystery.